On the 5th of March 2025, Chinese startup Monaco, a subsidiary of the Tencent-based Butterfly Effect, released the first ever general AI agent, Manus. Manus is a completely autonomous AI agent that can independently plan trips and analyze stocks without human intervention. Today, we'll explore this revolutionary AI system together and see how it's pushing the boundaries of what autonomous agents can accomplish in real-world scenarios. I'll walk you through Manus' impressive capabilities and why it's more advanced than chatbots like ChatGPT, OpenAI's Agentic AI, Deep Research, and reasoning models like DeepSeek's R1. Stay tuned to the end to see how this Agentic AI could transform everything from simple productivity to complex automation workflows, and what this means for the future of AI automation. Manus uses a multi-agent architecture where a central executor agent coordinates specialized sub-agents, such as planners and knowledge agents, to break down and execute complex tasks. The team behind Manus developed the agent by combining existing advanced AI models. Manus leverages the capabilities of fellow Chinese firm Alibaba's Quen and Anthropic's Claude, enabling it to execute various tasks, such as drafting research reports, However, the tool currently operates on an invitation-only basis. It faces challenges with its website as it grapples with heavy traffic and increasing malfunctions. The company recently acknowledged these issues on X, highlighting they are working on an immediate solution. To address the surge in traffic and broaden its user base, Manus AI has partnered with Quen. This collaboration could be a game-changer for both companies as Alibaba seeks to strengthen its position against competitors like DeepSeek and OpenAI. The partnership is based on Quen's open-source AI models, allowing Manus to enhance its functionalities as an AI agent. Both parties aim to create a smooth user experience by integrating these models with advanced computing platforms in China. This strategic alliance promises to improve Manus's operational efficiency and position Alibaba to gain a competitive edge in the rapidly evolving AI landscape. Could this partnership between Chinese tech giants reshape the global AI space? Western companies, particularly in the United States, may need to innovate faster to maintain their competitive edge. Is this collaboration a genuine threat or just healthy competition? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Competition aside, what are the key features that set Manus apart from existing AI models? Manus is designed to perform multi-step tasks with minimal human intervention, a game-changer in digital assistance. Rather than simply reacting to user prompts, Manus can autonomously plan, execute, and refine tasks. The vision for Manus goes beyond what traditional chatbots offer. It aims to be a genuine digital assistant that can make informed decisions and complete tasks. Imagine giving this agent just one prompt and watching it create an entire results dashboard without further input. That's the kind of efficiency I'm talking about. Besides, it can execute tasks independently in the cloud. This means Manus can keep working on tasks even if you disconnect from the internet or unplug your device. I'm excited about Manus because of its potential to streamline how we interact with technology. Instead of getting caught up in back and forth exchanges, I can envision a future where Manus anticipates my needs and takes action proactively. It's like having a partner that understands and optimizes my workflow without me having to micromanage every step. This leap towards a more intuitive and self-sufficient AI experience is not just about convenience, it's about empowering users to focus on what truly matters while leaving the tedious tasks to a capable assistant. I'm impressed by how Manus interacts with the live web. Thanks to its access to a digital ocean of information, it can independently seek out and verify information using various online sources. I mean, it's a research assistant who's always on the job tirelessly surfing the web for the most accurate data. What stands out to me is that it doesn't just fetch information, it actively engages with different websites, adding a new layer of depth to its findings. This AI agent can also access social media platforms like X, formerly Twitter, Telegram, and others to gather and process data. It can even handle multiple screens at a time. It's particularly helpful how Manus showcases its workflow in real time. This transparency allows users to see how it gathers and processes data. Instead of just delivering answers, it brings us along, making the whole experience feel more interactive and trustworthy. Isn't this a great reminder of how technology can enhance our understanding of information while keeping us in the loop? How do you see this balance between AI automation and human oversight evolving in the coming years? Leave your comments below. 
And also, if you're enjoying the video so far, kindly like and subscribe to this channel so you don't miss out on future updates. Besides, it encourages YouTube to show this video to others. Thanks a lot, and let's get back to the video. I've realized that Manus has some impressive adaptive learning and optimization features. It can tune into how users interact with it, allowing for a more personalized experience. It learns and evolves based on our preferences, which makes the responses relevant, efficient, and of higher quality. It's interesting to see how this adaptability works in real time, enhancing the overall interaction. As I use Manus, it's increasingly customized to fit my specific needs. This ongoing refinement sets it apart. Over time, it feels less like a generic tool and more like a companion that understands what I want. Manus has impressive multimodal capabilities. This powerful tool can handle various data types, making it super versatile. For instance, when it comes to text, it can generate detailed reports and answer all sorts of questions you might have. It's like having a knowledgeable assistant at your fingertips, ready to help with any written task you need. But that's not all. Manus also shines at visual content. It can analyze images, providing insights beyond what's on the surface. And if you're into programming, you'll appreciate its ability to work with code, automating tasks to make your coding life easier. Whether you want to streamline your work or dive deep into data analysis, Manus has got you on multiple fronts. Could this be the AI assistant that finally addresses all your productivity needs? What aspect of this multi-talented AI agent are you most excited to explore? One of the features of Manus that stands out to me is how seamlessly it integrates with advanced external tools. For instance, it works wonderfully with code editors, providing AI-assisted programming support that can enhance productivity. Plus, it connects effortlessly with database management systems, making it a breeze to handle structured data. It can also deploy applications, including setting up websites and hosting services on public URLs. This versatility is a game changer for anyone in tech or data management. Manus empowers businesses to automate their workflows effectively. Imagine having a tool that supports your coding needs and streamlines your data handling processes all in one package. It opens up so many possibilities for improving efficiency and reducing manual tasks. Now let's see how Manus performs against other AI agents. Although we don't have extensive benchmark data, Manus AI has undergone evaluation through the Gaia benchmark. This test is a benchmark that evaluates how effectively general AI assistants, or Gaia, tackle real-world challenges. Manus AI makes quite the impression in different difficulty levels. In level 1, which involves basic tasks, the agent scored an impressive 86.5%, outshining OpenAI Deep Research's 74.3% and significantly improving upon the previous state-of-the-art score of 67.9%. Moving on to level 2, where intermediate tasks are on the table, Manus continued to shine with a solid score of 70.1%, just edging out OpenAI's 69.1% and surpassing the prior best of 67.4%. Finally, in level 3, which features more complex challenges, Manus still took the lead with a score of 57.7%. It's a high score compared to OpenAI Deep Research's 47.6% and the earlier benchmark of 42.3%. Manus is setting new standards across the board as the most capable autonomous AI agents currently available. That brings us to the real-world tasks that Manus can perform. Manus offers various solutions to simplify our lives. When planning a trip, it crafts a personalized list of locations and provides a tailored travel handbook for your adventure. Regarding stock analysis, Manus features visually engaging dashboards that offer deep insights into market performance and financial health. Additionally, it aids in real estate research, helping you assess properties for affordability. This tool can make your investment decisions easy and more informed. If you run an online store, upload your Amazon or Shopify sales data, and Manus will provide actionable insights, detailed visuals, and tailored strategies to boost your sales performance. When sourcing suppliers for your business, Manus dives deep into extensive networks to find the perfect suppliers that meet your unique needs. Think of Manus as your dedicated agent, always working in your best interest to help you succeed. Contrary to what's going around the internet, that Manus AI is launching their own crypto token as a use case, the company claimed the news is fake. As we've seen, Manus is a first of its kind, and China's rapid advancements in AI with tools like DeepSeek R1 are challenging the conventional wisdom that has long placed the US at the forefront of this technology. 
It raises important questions about the future of AI and global power dynamics. So what do you think? Is China's approach reshaping the game, or is Silicon Valley still leading the charge? I'd love to hear your thoughts. Drop your opinions in the comments below. Let's keep the conversation going. If you enjoyed the video and want to stay updated on all things AI and tech, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.